What is going on, everybody? Riddles here back again. This is the Riddle Me This podcast. Thank you so much for tuning in for today's video. It's been a minute since I've been on here uh, putting out content. I do apologize. I know that I said that I had another video lined up in the last one that I uh, that I posted. And I never got around to it. I am very, very sorry about that. Things came up, and I just couldn't get around to it. Um... Frankly, this video that I'm doing right now, I meant to do yesterday, and I just, I never got around to it, so I apologize there as well. But, in case you didn't know, um, Chris Calico, um, the protege of Tech 9 um, been with Strange Music... Tech Nine's label since the very beginning of the label's inception is no longer with the label. Second, um, he has departed from the label, um, which is really strange because just two days prior to all this, Tech Nine um, was uh, promoting. A show on social media, you know, in Wisconsin featuring Chris Calico. So now that show hype, and then Chris Calico suddenly leaving the label, um, and also um, his merchandise has been removed from the Strange Music web store. Um, and he has been removed from the artist section on Strange Music, on Strange Music's, uh, official website. Um, so, you know, you know, it leaves a lot of speculation, um, just up in the air, you know, was it, uh, business money related, was it a mutual thing? Etc. Um, you, you know, I don't... I don't think that there's really any... beef or animosity towards Tech 9 and Chris Calico. I mean, they pretty much spent all these years together putting out all this dope music together. Um... You know, there never really seemed to be any bad blood or any tension, but who knows what, you know, really goes on behind the scenes. You know, we don't get to see that. But, um, Chris Calico, um, had put something on social media. Uh, it was a photo of him and Tech 9 and it said, uh, spent half my life with this guy right here doing what I was born to do. Thanks for all the years, bro. Sad face. At the real Tech Nine. Um, and then, of course, you know it. Uh, his uh, his artist section on Strange Music's website and his merchandise has been removed as well. Um, he also uh, tweeted out. Uh, all I can say is thank you, guys in parentheses, all the fans, for being a part of my life, you mean more to me than you know. Um, Tech had even said something, um, you know, regarding uh, Chris Calico. You know, Chris Calico is married. Uh, he has kids that aren't fully grown yet. Um, you know, Tex kids are pretty much fully grown. Chris Calico's are not. Um, so, you know, maybe he went home to be with his family. To be, you know, to, to be a husband and a dad. You, you, know, you know, because I'm sure him being in the music business, the music industry, and having to, you know, 
be at this place, be at that place, you know, five or six places at one time, you know, and re writing, recording, um, you know, putting albums together and uh, touring, you know, pr promoting his music and everything. That has really put a strain on his family relationships and, you know, maybe it's, maybe, maybe he just thought, you know, I should take a step back for a little while, you know, go home, spend time with my family, recharge, rejuvenate, and, you know, I, I don't think this is the end for Chris Calico as far as music, um, you know, I can see him, you know, taking a little break and resting and recharging his batteries and putting out music, you know, with or without strange music. Um, you know, maybe we get some mu some music from him down the line that's just strictly independent through him with no, no label behind it. Or he takes a break for a little while and then comes back to strange music, welcome back with open arms. Who knows... But Chris Calico is definitely one of my favorite artists, um, and you know, such great songs that have moved me and helped me throughout my my life and my struggles. You know, Hello, uh, Hello Walls created a monster, Unstable, Misunderstood, Bipolar, Anxiety, um, Titties. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I had to throw that in there. I love that fucking song. Um, you know, Scars, thank God. Proof of God. Just all all these great songs. And, you know, like I said, I don't think this is the end musically for Chris Calico. It's just time for him to stop what he's doing, step back, take a break, and be with his wife and kids. You know, Family is important, and, you know, I've, I've always felt the sense that family is very important to Chris Calico. But again, so is his career, and so is music, and it's hard to juggle those two things. But then, you, you know, you just take a step back for a while, and you realize what's truly important to you, and you gravitate towards that. And I think, you know, he's, he's finally, you know, he's finally come to to the conclusion that his family, his wife and his kids, you know, he he doesn't get to you know probably really see them all that often, you know, with touring and you you know and all that like I said, so he's he's going home for a little while and uh, I wish him all the best, all the luck in the world and his future endeavors and what he does from here on out. With, with or without strange music, you know, um, would I personally like to see him come back to strange music? Yes, um, because that's, that's where he started, and, you know, that's where I would, you know, ultimately like to see him finish his, his career out, um, when he decides, you know, to fully, you know, hang it up, so, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below video responses, things like that. Um, and that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I am Riddles. This is the Riddle Me This podcast. And until next time, peace out, and I will talk to you later. Have a good night.